Oh my god! I know it feels like somebody's watching me. What's up? Oh, he just hides inside and he just goes back. Look how cute that is. That's adorable. It's like a puppy. It's literally like a puppy. Look. <laughs> Look, Lily, he's walking. It's moving. It's so big and so heavy. We like gifts. Okay. okay. The best gifts? The best gifts. This thing out. It's Dude. all yours. It is? It. Wait, is this fresh water or salt water? Salt water. Salt water. Wait, what? Salt, salt water? Salt Taste water. that. Salt water? Huh? It's salt water. Salt water? Salt water. Okay. Let's see. What's in here? I don't know. Oh my god! What up, Slayers? We're back at it with another Slay Venture, and I'm here with Lily. Hello. And we're heading to Beverly's. Beverly's called me, Beverly's Pet Center, and they told me they have a nice little surprise for both of us, actually. So let's go ahead and head over there and see what it is. So we're here at Beverly's Pet Center. Let's go ahead and look around while we wait for that manager that called us. All right, all righty, all righty, all righty. We just finished looking around. No, I'm joking, guys. All right, we're gonna really look around. So we have tin foil barbs, just a regular little baby arowanas in the bike right there. We have silver doll hairs, which are pretty big, actually, believe it or not. I actually personally like red hooks, but uh, what are these things? What are those? Snakeskin garamis? Interesting. Very interesting. They probably look very scaleless. That's interesting. It looks cool though, right? That's a pretty fish. It's a pretty fish. You're a pretty fish, baby. Okay. Oh my God, look, 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 look. Baby piranhas? No way. Are they? Baby Red piranhas? Oh, you ruined it. They were supposed to be piranhas. They look like piranhas though. This is what, it's kind of hard to go ahead and distinguish the difference. What's going on? How's Tank doing? Tank is doing good. Yeah. How are you, man? Look at this guy. Leave me alone. I'm trying to make a video. Nemo! Hello! Dude, I love clownfish. Aren't they pretty? They're so pretty. Look at the colors. I love saltwater fish. Maybe one day. I've been saying it for years now. What? Oh, that looks like a saltwater discus, but it's just a dory. Or oh, tang. Let me be let me be proper. Whoa! Did you see that? What? It opened up his dorsal and anal fin at the same time. Open up. Do it again. Yes. You listen to me. Look at that. Woo! What are you? Hello. It's like a grouper. Look at this thing. Oh, that's pretty. It is pretty. But it could be a squirrel fish too. Oh, it's kinda high. It is. Look at this. Oh my gosh. Love these groupers. My favorite. So Panther cool. groupers are so cool. Look at those eyes. Can't believe they get so big in the wild too. Nice. These are the ones I like. I like big tin foil barbs and red hooks. Look at how big those red hooks are. See them? Massive. Families of the silver doll hairs. Doll hairs. Look at the true frontosa right here. Look at that. Look at that head. It's almost as big as your forehead. Oh, stop. Look at that thing. Look at us. Look at that massive thing. It shines. Dude, what the heck is this thing? It's a lele. A lele yuppie. Lele yuppie. U-P-I-P-U-P. We all pee. Oh my god. I know it feels like somebody's watching me. Dude, that thing is crazy. Ugly. I wonder why they keep these in these containers. I'm not really versed in the saltwater life, but these poor guys are in containers so guys in the comments below let me know what's going on and why they keep them separated as well as in containers i guess they escape or something or they're very very vicious i mean they're called blue spot jawfish those are cool those are cool oh my god lily octopus these are so cool yeah they have to keep the rocks so they don't want to escape and everything that's so fire look at that maybe one day Maybe one day we'll get an octopus or something, you know? It's like a dream to get a saltwater tank, but I'm just not ready for it, nor I really have a desire, you know? Oh my gosh, what's it doing? It's just moving? I don't know. It's changing it's colors. trying to go to the purple Look thing. at those chambers. This is so cool. Oh, he's changing colors oh. again. Whoa. He's changing colors to the purple. That is so amazing. I love octopus. Whoa. They taste good too. Look at this guy, hey. What's up? Oh, he just hides inside oh. and he just goes back. Look how cute that is! Aww. That's adorable. It's like a puppy. It's like, literally like a puppy. Look! <laughs> oh my god! Look at this thing. Look at this. It's, oh, it's what is this? Siren? Is this a greater is siren? That? Hold on, we're going on the other side. That could be a greater siren. Oh my god, it is. Lily, it is. 
It's Bob. It's Bob on steroids. Wild World of Farley has a Bob. It's a greater siren. This is the biggest one I've ever seen. Look how big it is. It's literally full grown. 100% full grown. And it's actually kind of light. It looks like an African lungfish. Oh my gosh. You and this Oscar are having moments. It's huge. Matt, you can't really see the colors. Put your hand up here. See what happens. Oh, oh my, my gosh. gosh. It's so active and so responsive. Look at that. Isn't that thing cool, man? It's so cool. Wow. Look at the colors now. We can see them on this side. How red. It's not even a tiger Oscar. In the comments below, what Oscar do you think this one is? It's so red. It's so gorgeous. And look from above. It's so personable. Look at that. Oh my God. I wonder if this is for sale. And look at Bob. The greater sign is massive. It's gorgeous. You should look from above, babe. Look, Lily, he's walking. It's moving. It's so big and so heavy. That is wild. We got Stuff something right. better for you, man. Oh, you ready? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, man. All right. We got you something, right? All, All right. right. Come around here. What'd you get? Oh. I'm excited. You I like. Gifts. I love gifts. Who doesn't love gifts? We like gifts. Okay. Okay. The best gifts. Oh my yeah. God! You guys are already. What is Check this? this thing out. Dude, it's all yours. Say it is. Name on it. Really? Where's my name? Back. Oh, okay. Yeah. That works. Too. <laughs> <laughs> so what's what's in here? What, what's what in we here? Got in this thing? What is this? What we got in this thing? What's in it? Oh, someone pop the hood. I don't think you know. Pop the hood. Let's go. What is this? Is this fresh water or salt water? LEDs. Oh, look at that. Wait, wait. Is this fresh water or salt water? Salt water. Salt water. Wait, what? Salt, salt water. Salt water. Taste that. Salt water? Huh? It's salt water. Salt water. Salt water. Okay. Let's see. What's in here? I don't know. Oh my god, no, you're scared. Oh <laughs> <laughs> got oh. Lily. What's in here? For real, for real. I don't know, man. I love rocks, but this yeah, is. Yeah, it's only rock. What is this? Wait. Oh, oh my no god. Dude, is that a mantis shrimp? Look at that. Oh my god, it's a peacock mantis shrimp. Grab him, dude. Oh. No? Dude. Let's get a close up look at him. Dude, this is insane. Oh my god. Look at him. Dude, these things are notorious tank crushers, they break tanks. Look at that guy. Dude, hold on. Thanks, guys. Oh, dude, no problem, That's man. what I'm talking about. Thanks, man. Dude, this is so sick. Look at him. Oh my, I, I have no words. I am speechless. This is a dream come true. Come on. I've always wanted one of these. They're so pretty. Oh, and he's gone. We call him Little Joey. Call him Little Joe? I like it. Little Joe. I like it. Little Joe. He's Little like, Joe. You know, he's like Little Joe. Little Joe. Little Joe. <laughs> <laughs> All right, sweet. So, well, we have a saltwater tank now. All right, we got to right, get this thing out of here. All right. Oh, wait, see you ya. Take my shirt off. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, we're going to move this thing out of here and I'll meet you guys at my apartment. We have everything all set up, good to go. I want to say thank you, no Joe, on here at Beverly Center. Yeah. To my boy. What is your name, by the way? Derek. Derek, thank you, Derek, for setting this up and having it all perfect for us. Guys, if you want anything you like know? this, Come to Beverly. It's absolutely insane and perfect for your everyday needs, especially if you're here in South Florida. That's true. We're out of here. We're to put our boy in his new tank at the new place. Help me. Help me now. All right, Slayers, we're at the sleigh pad with our brand new tank and our brand new Mantis. Can you go ahead and hold him up to the light a little bit so we can go ahead and see how pretty he is? Oh my gosh. Look at the red, the orange. This is a dream come true, guys. Shout out to Beverly's Pet Center. Oh my goodness, what an amazing gift. Look at that. So These are the strongest animals. They definitely pack a punch, literally. They have little clubs there that spring out and everything. Uh, I'll show you when he's in the tank. So we're going to go ahead and add the rocks, recreate the exact setup they had over there at Beverly's, and we'll be good to go. Here it is, my first saltwater tank with a surprise little monster. Isn't that cool? It's awesome. It's awesome. So the little surprise monster is the following. We have a beautiful mantis shrimp. That is right. Mr. Mantis swim, there you go, woo! He is so cool swimming around. I'm gonna go ahead and give you some fun facts about these guys, but first let's go ahead and get him acclimated to his tank. Alrighty, so let's go ahead and add our beautiful mantis shrimp into a cup real quick so you guys can analyze him. Carefully. Can't spill salt water because it's so precious. Come, my friend. Slide in. Ooh. Ooh. Dude. Hold on. Let me put you guys up. Look, look at this. Look at this, guys. Look at the colors. I don't know if you guys can see. It's red on the bottom on his fins, the greens, his face, the blues, the yellows. The green peacock mantis shrimp. This has been a dream of mine since I've been a little kid. 
and someone actually made it happen. Look below. Look at that. Oh my gosh. The colors are absolutely insane. And with the right lighting and the right filtration, this guy could get massive, probably about five to six inches in captivity. In the wild, I've seen them 12 inches. So we're gonna keep them here. This tank is perfect for them. It's about a 15 gallon flew off sex tanks. You know that I love them. All of my friends have them. Catch them all fishing, wild world of Farley. Yeah, I only have two friends. Just kidding guys, all the other YouTubers down here also love these tanks. And what I'm gonna do is actually add them inside. He's perfect, he's about, ah, uh, what'd you say, about two and a half, maybe three inches? Yeah. Something like that, but they'll get big, they'll moat like crawfish. Hopefully we can go ahead and document him doing all that on camera, but I've been thinking about a name now. Look at these eyes, I don't know if you guys can see. He's moving a lot, look at those eyes. If you guys can zoom in and stuff, check that out. Please. Look at those eyes. So they pack a punch, a serious punch. And those little things right there, the little red clubs, he smashes. So I was thinking about naming him Hulk, cause you know, Hulk smash, or one of my personal favorite boxers, Tyson. Yes, Mike Tyson. So in the comments below, let me know what name you want. You can either comment Tyson for Mike Tyson or Hulk. Whichever gets more votes, that's the name I'll go ahead and choose for our beautiful peacock mantis shrimp. He is insane, he's so shy. These guys are known to be tank breakers. So I know it's kind of hard to see him and everything right now. Let's go ahead and add him to our tank. And since it's his water, we don't really have to acclimate it. So bear with me as I add my dude. Check it out. Go ahead, my guy. Go ahead. Whee! Oh, there you go, he just woke up. Look oh. at him swim around, he's on this side. Dude, he is so cool. He's awesome. He's such an inquisitive creature. It's insane. Because he could bust the glass if you piss him off. He is nothing but a savage. He is literally what I've always wanted, a true slayer. And with that being said, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Again, comment what we should name our Peacock Mantis Shrimp. And again, shout out to Beverly's Pet Center. They really, really outdid themselves and hooked it up. And so on a good note, I'll see you on the next adventure. Booyah. <laughs>